Yeah, 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 y
not not the 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 the, the, the gas rema sure gas gas as long as Wicknow can supply whatever gas is to Aris gas Ari. <laughs> that's not real shit. <laughs> it's, it's, it's that's funny. not the gas you want that's but yeah, funny. it's another banger it's another banger it's another episode the boys are here boys are back shout out to the to the coffee buyers shout out to the gang in the comments we see you it's leaderboard we, coming we, we have actually ordered leaderboard it's coming that's it's why that's why today we didn't mention you, you mention know, because, because next one the next one is be, just we are, we 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 no long talk we are just going to point you just see your name here up good up, up. and hey shout out to shout out to everybody buying coffees because very soon you guys will see like a big change in here or you might not it might, it might decide to use the money for, for other you know Zanupia of related reasons I mean if you guys if you guys no 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 so, you have done so that so we might do it we might might not we might or we might not <laughs> be prepared but uh, it's good to be back my brother always always good to be back speaking of week now Age, age, that's you know. not a good place. <laughs> no, no, I'm just, I'm just going off. Uh, I'm just going These off. These are the uh, makings of a lawsuit. I, I mean, well, speaking of, speaking of your so, honor, so. and then they said, and then they said on episode ten, and then they said, speaking of three minutes forty three seconds into the episode, damn, you didn't even help yourselves. But what do you have, Chef Munashi? What do you have cooking for us? No, no, no. But speaking of week now, right? Um. You know, there were some interesting comments and uh, engagement on on the platforms, mm. and uh, remember how we touched on how a state has failed. And this is a point that you like making mm. about, hey man, when people aspire to be bingas mm. uh, rather than, you know, um, and I think this also ties into into the whole outlook yeah. and the polarity of people saying ah come to the uk or oh, stay home hustle i guess what i wanted to touch up on and pick your brain on comb through was the notion of hustling yeah yeah doing your own thing going out there grind grind in grind out or just being employed and playing it safe just go to your nine to five. Know that on Friday, if I finish work at five, I'm done. Done with your asses. I'll see you Monday. Goodbye. Clock out. Hey. That's a tough one, man. That's that's really that's really it. And I think because someone accused my, Zimbabweans of being very good employees rather than entrepreneurs. But at the same time, I think what? Zimbabweans, no, I mean, when we come abroad, yeah. rather, but at home, the, 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 the environment dictates, because the, that that discourse came from, oh, we've got such a high literacy rate, we always boast that we're so educated, but mm. the way we're educated, it's not in a way that promotes innovation, so to speak, particularly locally back in Zim. Mm. I mean, I think abroad, we are great innovators, funny enough, but at home, people are hustling, but they're not really innovating. So what... So, Man, I, 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 I always... Uh, for the most part, these conversations tire me because half the people that are having them don't even realize the privilege they have to be having that those conversations. Okay. Right? <clears throat> the starting position needs to be recognizing your privilege. Mm-hmm. For us to be sitting here right now doing a podcast, lights on, fancy equipment, well, what, that's privilege. If anything, are going that on is the from, we, can, we can leave the lights on too. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, that is the epitome of privilege. Okay. Waffling opinions that no are, one asked for. No one asked for, not factual for the most part, just funny. That's privilege. Just freestyling right? off the dome. <laughs> I say that to say you can't accuse a people that have not been given the same level of privilege of not innovating. Okay. Because the first port of call for most people in Zimbabwe is survival. Mm -hmm. If all my brain power is being dedicated to making it to the next day, Mm -hmm. why would I be thinking about the best use of lithium? (laughs) 
<laughs> that is... I've never seen what lithium looks like. Is it a dust? Is it a dombo? <laughs> is, is it, it a what? What is it? What? You know? I see. Uh, the, the, it, it, lithium hasn't even been put into our textbooks yet. Oh, I don't think it has. Do you get what I mean? But so, then, I, but, but here's the thing now, in terms of innovation, yeah. like when you're a student, when you're at school, yeah. It's that ground level grassroots type of stuff yeah. that I'm talking about. It hasn't been put in a textbook. Why hasn't it been put in a no, textbook? No, so it's so 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 it's even even there, even in those grassroots, even on those grassroots level, even in high school, we spoke about this the other time. Our 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 social fiber, our moral fiber has changed from the time when we were in high school. Okay. Right? Bro, when we were in high school. No one was thinking about being a comedian as a career. <laughs> That's true. Were you? <laughs> were I mean, you thinking about was... turning dancing into a career? Or was that a mm, thing that no, you did and you no. were like, at some point I'm going to outgrow this? No, no. And were you even thinking about being a sportsman? For all the sports that you did, were you even thinking you know, about that as for, a career? For, for, for a split second, I no, no, I'd become he, a pro cricket I mean, player. Yeah, but... Most of us, most yeah, children, yeah, fair, regardless fair, of how talented fair. you are, you're just told that this is the thing that you're doing in high school, uh -huh. either playing football, the real thing. Like I'm the saying, real thing is when coming. we yeah. were, yeah, when yeah, we yeah, were yeah, in that's high school, true, that's true. That's that was true. that's true. To a large extent, I'm saying that to say, even if parents wanted to see that education is the key to success right now, mm -hmm. it's not even believable. Okay. Because your child is going to look at you like, what did you do with your education? Okay. Because. There is a high likelihood that the parent who's trying to enforce education is the key to... So they don't even believe what they're saying. They can't sell it. But our parents were civil servants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who were, like, for the, for the, for the entire time that we were, that we were, uh, uh, that I was in primary, primary and, and high school, high school. education. Yeah, yeah. My father was a policeman. Mm -hmm. We lived in police accommodation. Moms was it, a teacher. Moms was a teacher. We didn't pay rent. We didn't pay. He could sell me. The fact that, oh, yeah, you can tell me with this is not happening. Do you get what I mean? Fair. Like at the time that he was a policeman, Fair. it was a respectable living. Fair it wasn't enough. the fanciest job. But, but he could argue that I put myself through school. I passed reasonably uh, enough. Yeah, yeah, to yeah, have, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, you've got a roof over your head, don't you? Many parents can't do that now. Damn. Do you get what I mean? Because I'll be like, you're struggling, bro. Come exactly. on. Exactly. Many parents Stop can't, it. can't, can't hit their kids with it. Because but so then we default to that mbinga. Because it looks like all the mbingas are there. But then when we try to trust the success, how do you explain money laundering to a grade seven? Oh, that's long. So now those questions of every other week we are seeing doctors striking. Atinama gloves, atinamachi. So Mass children, migration. It's not even a sexy... Impulse. Children can't even say, I want to be a doctor. I'm like, could we just say, could we not strike? Do you know what I mean? Just to strike? So it's it's a it's a very complicated question. It's a very... it's a very diff I would say, again, I'm recognizing the privilege because privilege... I remember Dave Chappelle saying... When that happened to me, I did what most men in America cannot afford to do. Mm. I sat down with my thoughts and... Oh, right. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. That's true. You, know, you think it's about to say something out there? She was like... And then I really thought about it. it was, Yo, sh the ability to sit down the, with your thoughts, thoughts is privilege, bro. That is... Let me go. Oh, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. That's so too. Oh, to to this January, there is, there is a good portion of the population in Zimbabwe that, of parents that was crying, that are still crying. Mm. Well, school fees went up, rent went up. What, what? So, so I, I, I was going to say, recognizing your privilege and sitting down and thinking, I think the conversation between entrepreneurship and nine to five really comes down to what am I good at? 
That is true. Most people are not being honest with themselves. Mm. We are not all entrepreneurs, bro. Wait, that's that, and that's that, that's kind of where I wanted to. It sounds to sexy, arrive but at. It sounds sexy, but sometimes you're not cut out for that. If you're in an environment or an economy that doesn't require you to be a guavist to be to hold a PhD in guaviology, don't in guavinomics. Sometimes I think just do yourself a favor, bro. Just. Go work. Just go. Just do nine to five. Get your pension sorted. You know, have have your taxes paid when you get your wages. Yeah. Like you don't even have to have a personal relationship with the HMRC. Don't, bro, they don't need the gateway number. What? Gateway? I. That she when he sometimes refuses to log in. I'm like and that. It is the most frustrating thing ever. I thought I was the only one. No, no. It's a biff- thing. I've been beefing with those niggas. This, but 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 but. but perfect example in my household we are complete opposite my mm-hmm. wife is a scientist nice for her nine to five proper she knows friday when she clocks out she's done she's, she's done with your ass is done she, you no one even knows to call my number on a saturday you know. like don't even no, think about they don't it have, they don't don't please don't you know nine to me. five she doesn't She's not asking good Mati Maria Rushkarini. But you know, payday Yangu is on this she's invoice. Not, yeah, offer. There's we're never just, a we're time just waiting for she's like Pane Anna married Zinu Mepo. Hey, the way we have married Yo, bro. Just today, right we're not calling. Yo, <laughs> yo, how, hey, the deposit. How far? Hey, how, how, yo, <laughs> hey, white man. Hey. Where my money? <laughs> because I remember when you wanted me to pay this money, you put a deadline on you that put shit. A, that is so real. But me on the other side, I'm like, yo, all my things are staggered on some, you know. <sighs> I, 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 I eat what I kill. It's literally that. So eating what you kill is long. I eat like in 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 the, on paper, mm. my shit sounds fancy. Right? It sounds because, like oh. because I, I come and go as I please. I'm I can wake up and I'm decide. I'm my own boss. Do I, I want to decide... shoot today? Nah. Mm-hmm. Do I know right? Leave I'm... days, personal time off. <laughs> oh dear, Kandoro. Dear, dear Mugu. <laughs> Signed off by Kandoro. Kandoro. <laughs> Sounds about right. Sounds about. Oh, you want? But but <laughs> you just the... wake up to yourself and say, "I'm going in sick today." Yeah. But the flip side to that is the sleepless nights that come with the uncertainty of, "Oh, I eat what I kill." Did I really kill that? Did I kill? Oh, shit. Was to Did you do it live? You're like, oh, man. Play dead. <laughs> That's incredible. So like myself, yeah. Um, you you went down the, the, the educational route. Like yeah. I, I tried. Man, give it a uh, step. I, I gave it a step. <laughs> I mean, I, I gave it a stab. At some point, I wanted to be a scientist as well. Yeah. Uh, at some point, I genuinely thought, I genuinely thought, I was going to be a gynecologist when I was uh, when I was young. Let's put a okay. How young? Ten. Okay. From when I was ten years old. Okay. Because I, was... I, I thought if I'm if I'm not going to be a cricketer, I'm going to be either an engineer. Hey, I was about to slander or... your, your name. <laughs> yeah. I was like... Then you say I 10, I was it. like, you know, 10, 10 is innocent. Can't be. If you had told me you thought about that when you were in high school, I was like, hey. Yeah, hey, check, go hey, get that checked out. Hey, 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 hey. hey, hey. This, hey. Is, this is some boy school shit. Hey, dog. <laughs> <laughs> so like, there's way too many men way, around. Like, way too, hey. Who are these niggas? <laughs> who are these niggas? Yeah, but 10 is 10. 10, 10 is no boy. He was like, no, so when I was 10 years old, my uh, my mom's sister... Um, my aunt, my mom's cousin, um, was a receptionist, a secretary for for a gynecologist, a very yeah. well known gynecologist, yeah. Doctor Chipato. Yeah. And uh, this is when we used to live in the avenues in in H. You've and been around. I've been, bro. I've been back when the avenues were the where avenues. the avenues. Like, this is Didi Musa Lala. Yeah. Uh. And you know what I mean? Like a muka one day, you know, like a presser, dick and the mom's son, and the commotion. Men, I didn't want to go as a dry shoe. Mr. Porter, Mr. Porter, 
Yeah, back in the day. Uh, and I always used to walk past, but I'd always pop in and say, what's up? Because it was on my route to school. Yeah. And I'd pop in to say hello, hello, but there was a plaque outside that said Dr. Chipato, gynecology, yeah, doctor in gynecology or something. And yeah. I was like, what the fuck is that word? What is that? What is that? And I went and asked my aunt and I was like, what, what is that? And then she's like, oh, you look it up. Dr. Arcads. Yeah. And I was like, Dr. Arcads. And I thought that was very fascinating because mm. I've always genuinely found it fascinating that women can... Can carry so, a, a baby or, or, in yeah. their belly. I was like, "Oh, so like a human being." I was like, "Oh, that's that's interesting." So I tried science, but your your so so basically, even from ten years, your whole it was either cricket or science. You were in yeah. the world of science. I, I was. I would, I I genuinely science engineering. I yeah, because yeah. science even as I got to high school, science yeah, particularly biology yeah, it just kind of came easy to me i just had the general natural fascination to it yeah. and then you know when i got to after high school i went and i, I went and i i did biomedical science yeah at uh, nottingham trent university mm. and i think that's when hey. what was the song do you know Zirigion Takawanda? Hey! <laughs> they try to do Bowser. Madimon. Madimon. I know my... Madimon. Who's the nigga who sang that? Mechanic. Who's the mechanic? Who's the mechanic? Madimon. Oh, that was a banger. Yeah, clapper. Was. That was a clapper. That was a clapper. Yeah. And so, hey! But my, my dismount from that... Yeah. ...was, uh, was very gutsy. I must. How how walk, I workers must admit. workers. So you I must admit you 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 are in high school in Zimbabwe. At some point, you relocate to to uh, the UK. To the UK. You, had you already finished uh, high school by the time you came here, or you? I came here when I was starting my A levels. Okay. At a, a So what did you what do you do at A levels? <clears throat> so I did a very weird combination of subjects right. because. They just didn't want to recognize some of the subjects from Zim or something oh, right, like that. Right, right, right. So I ended up doing biology, food technology, right. which made sense. Yeah. And then they just went left field mm. and they gave me sociology, mm. which I guess can kind of work, and flipping religious studies. Mm. What the fuck is that? Or like I, I can uh, see it, Papa. What are you talking about? Science is it? I don't know. My arts and I don't know. They just. Humanities, they call them some racismo. I don't know some racismo. So I did those for yeah. for for my for my A levels, and I went to to uni. But then error the error that happened was, as I was about to go for for biomeds at Nottingham Trent. Yeah. Um, mm. I get to the end of my A levels, and then you know Zimbabwe just follows me. The stench of it just hits yeah. me. Some technical shit just hit. Yeah. <laughs> so when you come to, to England, you may have recourse to public funds, but you need to be in the country for a minimum of three years. Mm. I'd only been in the country for two years because right. I did AS and A2, which would be law six, upper six. Yeah. And I finished that. I thought I'm going to go straight into uni. And these men just told me on a last minute that... I'm ineligible for student loans, for student finance. Mm. So it's either I had to defer, take a gap year so that I get to three years and then I'm eligible for student funding because big man, ain't nobody was paying nine grand out of pocket. Mm. No, 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 don't do that. And that, so whilst that happened in that gap year mm. is the time where I sat down with my thoughts Mm. And I was like, hmm. hmm. Yeah, no, 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 it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. I'm going to do this biomedical science thing, have that as a nice, strong, solid fallback. But I want to see this comedy thing, though. So it wasn't even necessarily performance art, performance art. Mm. I just wanted to do comedy. Right. So it's around about that time I started writing little sketches and making yeah. sketches in that time. And I ain't never cool it, but like I might even pull out some of the old golden oldies from back in the day. The people deserve. Yeah. And then by the time I got to knots now, uh that's when I when I got there, I was like, ah, 
okay, now I really want to do stand-up, stand-up. Mm, mm. And as fate would have it, my student accommodation where it was, literally across the road, there was a pub that had an open mic right. night kind of thing. And I had read Paulo Coelho's The Alchemist mm. during my gap year. So I was getting a lot of ideas. Mm. Ah, then, you know, I do that. I was, I think I was kind of low-key depressed because mm. I just had a terrible start anyway. Mm. It was long because, but because, because I was, I thought I was going to uni last year. I booked my accommodation and whatnot, paid the deposit, blah, blah, blah. But there's a period where you can cancel it. If you don't cancel it, you're now liable for the whole year's worth of rent. But they only told me nine days out of the start of the, of the course and that window period is 21 days before you start. So I found myself in this weird legal funkery where I couldn't even get enrolled for the first two weeks at uni because they're like, we can't put you in the system until someone figured out that, oh, you owe the university 5,000 pounds. It's like, what the fuck for? For accommodation from last year. And I was like, how are you going to charge me a year's worth of rent for... For a yard I didn't even collect keys for. Come on. What did they end up doing? They forced me into a payment plan just so that I can enroll and start uni. Ah, bro, I... You actually paid? See, bro, I got into a payment plan for like a pound a month or something stupid. I don't even know. I think they're still looking for me. I was like, fuck y'all niggas. Yeah, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, I have a rough start and everyone knows the first couple of weeks of uni freshers and whatnot. Yeah, yeah. That's where everyone meets up and yeah. whatnot. I couldn't even get into my university accommodation because... <sighs> Without the enrollment, student finance doesn't get released into your account. Yeah. So it was just a clusterfuck of shit. And now, by the time I start, by the time I start, I'm just, I'm just in a funk. And uh, obviously, I'm, I'm muscled through. I'm yeah. doing what, no, what, no, what, no, what. And then I made friends with some guy who was in mass media mass communication right, he was right, doing right. some degree in that and then they were like oh because they, they had a radio station mm. and i think there was some talks of trying to do like a little tv station for that course and i thought oh i could write you some guys some items i was working as a door-to-door -door fundraiser mm -hmm. and i had I, an idea for for a tv show that would work well but then i didn't have the experience of writing within budget and when i was just yeah. writing some wild stuff and i had an exam uh, I had exams the following week, but I just found myself fixated on these scripts and whatnot. And then one day I just woke up and said, I'm like, fuck this. I'm going back home. Brother, when I went to Nottingham, we went with two cars. Mm. Two cars of your stuff. Of my stuff. Yeah. I couldn't call nobody to say, come pick me up and whatnot because I would have been talked out of it. Mm. Or, it would have to be my mom and my and my pops and they would have just gave me shit for it. So I just thought the only way to do this is to just dip. Mm. I packed my flat into bags, my changani bags, mbare bags, you know, the checkered how, ones. Uh, 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 backtrack, backtrack. Mm. This thought process, uh, uh, how how quick did it happen? Was it a graduate thing? It was a graduate or was one. It, was it a was it like a, a ping? Was it a ping? I mean, from the moment of realization, did you try to talk yourself out of it, or did you say this is what I'm doing? I'm doing it. I'm starting to pick. Yeah, it no, it was. Uh, it was. I think it had been underneath the surface. Yeah, it was bubbling. It was brewing all along yeah. because. Because now, with, 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 with the benefit of hindsight, I certainly remember when I, when I first got here and I was looking at a few prospectuses with my mom, like, where, where, what am I going to do? Am I going to college? Am I going to sixth form? My mom was heavy leaning onto sixth form because she was like, nah, academics, academics. I was like, yeah, I'm with you, I'm with you, I'm with you. But there was one prospectus I was looking at and it had a performance art course on mm. it. And I was like... You're looking hella cavish. I was like, that's kind of looking... Mm. Mm. And I said to my mom... What about this? He's like, fuck's wrong with you? I was like, okay, don't worry, don't worry. I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> so it always had been Suffers. kind of in there, yeah. but I just thought that, yeah. no, nah, let me do the education thing first yeah. and then whatever I do, I can do it with a nice fallback. Yeah. 
So it has been kind of there, but then I think I realized that, man, I just don't have the zeal yeah. for for what what ended up ticking me off. I yeah. think was lab. Mm. So I love biology, yeah. like that was my shit. But lab, lab, mm-hmm. lab. Like in the lab, lab yeah. reports, the yeah. boredom of it. And then I realized that if I'm to take up this and as a career and go forth mm. with it, the reality of it is what I'm most likely going to be doing as a job is this very thing. And I was like, no, 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 no I can't. No, no, so no. how long were you at Nottingham Trent? Oh, gosh. Almost a couple of years, I think. And then I just pulled the ejector. <laughs> Yeah, so you did first year first year second year i think just into second year right yeah that's when i was like well mm. because, because mm. now 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 that gives us a little bit of context because mm. your first narration sounds a little bit more dramatic oh no because no, you no. started off with you struggled with accommodation no, and then I know, the but next thing we saying, hear is but, but it set me off in, it set me off into a f- Funk, really? like, you, like so you're saying funk, like the whole year, like the whole year, man. You just put off the whole year. I was just oh, mm. it, terrible. So you were give, giving us terrible. context as to like how the like, it was never the likelihood of it turning it into something enjoyable. No, when you did the open mic, how did it go? <laughs> when I <laughs> I What's crazy is when I did the open mic, it just so happened to be an ACS night. So ACS is African and Caribbean Society. Right. So it's basically the black club at right, university. Right, right, like, Pro mm. comedy was terrible. It wasn't like the jokes were there, the vision was there, yeah. but just the was terrible. Like and then doing it. It was so bad. And then I was like, ah, oh, I dance, I dance too. <laughs> and then I danced. And then at the end of it, everyone was like, yo, you're a sick dancer, bro. And then they just kept running. <laughs> everyone just acted like the comedy didn't happen. They're like, nah, I'm, I'm going to shoot everyone. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm burning the place down. Mirai Panab. I'm trapped down. No, remember, remember, I'm sure they missed. They acted like the comedy didn't happen. The, the, no one acknowledged the oh, comedy. Oh, that's the worst. No one didn't. No one. No one. It's like I never held the mic. Oh, that's the worst. They said you got moves, bro. Hey. And you know what? I was so grateful like that. No, you. No, you. I'm so I, I see the. I'm so grateful. Like, whew. Yeah. God damn. Yeah. Only one of my boys, uh, yeah, Jibs and uh, Daryl, my housemates, my flatmates, they were like, ah, they were dying at the back. Because ah! they'd egg me on. They, they also, because you know, you have people around you. Yeah. They're like, man, you funny, bro. Like, you funny, funny. So, what did that feel like? Like, no, was that like, Hey, maybe this is not it. No, no, no. It didn't feel like that. I just realized I need to do some work because I was okay. like, man, God, I know I'm funny, man. The fuck right. out of here. I'm funny. I'm funny. I knew I was funny. But the way I dipped. Yeah. Bro, I packed up my flat into, you know, you can get in body bags, chunk yeah, bags, yeah. chicken items. Packed, 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 packed. Like pots, pans, bro. Like. Bags on bags. I think I had to do like, I don't know, a couple trips with my luggage. And I remember on Where one... were you taking them? National Express coach station. Oh. I'm getting on a coach. I'm moving my entire yard by bus. bus. Oh. That's how determined I was. Because I was like, hey man. I'm gone. I'm, I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm, I'm out. I'm out of here. Like I just needed to get to my myself to a point where I just can't look back. Like there's no undo. There's no undo here. It's done. No command Z. You can't do that, brother. I pack my my the, the last load. Mm. I get there. I think my coach was leaving at three p.m. or something stupid like that. Yeah. The cab stops across the the coach station. Mm. 
uh, I just about get there on time. I take half of my stuff. I put it in the coach. Pa, 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 pa. I tell the driver, I was like, yeah, I'm just going because I'd taken my stuff out of the cab. Half of it I've ferried. I've told the driver, just give me two seconds. I'm just taking this load and I'm coming back to get the other load. You looked me square in the eye. I was like, yeah, gotcha. He's like, bless. I put these things in the coach. I tell the coach driver, back in two minutes, I run back across the road. As I'm going, like this is a dual carriageway, busy road type of thing. As I'm about to cross, I'm looking across the road. This driver is pulling off. As he's pulling off, he's caught a couple of my bags with his tire. And as he's driving off, I just hear scraping. <laughs> Bro, did my man not drag my bags, rip them? Now my clothes, my pants, my pots are just on the side of the road. Why did you continue driving? I'm like, I'm looking at him. I'm like, yo, he's just looking at me like, I'm like, yo, he thinks I'm saying, he's like, I have to go. He thinks I'm saying, wait for me, but I'm saying you're driving over the shit. And then he realizes what he's doing and he's just like, fuck you. And he drove off anyway. I was like, what is this? Brand. You almost feel like it's a it's a it's a, it's an omen. I was like, I, the, and and again, I'd been reading Paulo Coelho, the, the alchemist, you up and I was like, these this these are the omens they write about in the book. Yoski, I grab my stuff. They're all over. I have to get black big black bin liners, black bags because just the stuff. Abazragamira, this niggas on some. I find a corner store. I've, Mm. Packing my things, packing my things, packing my things. As I pack my things, I just barely pack half of it. This is a good uh, bystander. Oh, mm. I was like, yeah, man, I'll wait. If you need a witness, I told them, I'll call the cab company, blah, blah, blah. I told my this and that, whatever. To grab the last bits as I'm running across, as I run across, as I get to the coach, this nigga's taking out all my other stuff that I had loaded, put it on the side. He's like, I got to dip. I was like, just give me two seconds. My things are over there. It's like, I got to go. Dips. Mm. Mm-mm. I'm like, what is this? Go back, grab the rest of my stuff, come back. I think there was another um, coach in about an hour, an hour and a half or so. Mm. Eventually, I get that coach. And I get home. I get home the following day mm. because I because my boy ended up picking me up. I ended up going to a party. His car is packed like this with, like, stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and I get home, my mom's like, Oh, nice to see you, my mom. Is it end of term? And then what? later she looks at she sees there's pots and pans. She's like, yo. There's a lot of stuff. How far, Jama? How long how long you run for? And I was like, hey, listen, I'm gonna be real with you. I ain't doing that no more. <laughs> She flipped. But credit to her, mm. the following morning she came, she had a bit of a think about it, and then she says, you know what, if that's what you've decided to do, that's fine. But I don't know what it is you wanna do. And I was like, I, I wanna, I wanna I wanna act, I wanna do performance, I wanna write, I wanna, I don't know. That's what I want, that's what I want to do. And she was like, okay, if you're going to do that, if you're going to do that, you're going to have to go to school for it. You, you're not mm. just going to go in my yard. I was like, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. She was like, yeah, and whatever you're going to go, you're going to have to, none of this, you go to uni halfway across up the country. It's like, you're going to have to find some university that's local and you're going to be living here, going and coming back. And so that's the price I mm. I paid for that. I was like, yeah, I just found some. Couldn't you have, couldn't you have, like in retrospect, mm. of course. Did you have the ability to switch things around and do performance out at Nottingham Trent? 
No, I couldn't. They didn't offer that altogether. Ah, right, at the right, university. right, right, right. And um, it also didn't help that I had deferred. Mm, so you well. already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you owe them five thousand. And I owe them five nag. And you want to? They're like, hey, yeah, hey, bro, hey. Big man, big man, big man. black. Aba, 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 and nah, sha, sha. What a black guy, oh. Black, you not even black. You um, black, black. Um, 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 no. <laughs> like we just opened the doors. That that's the, why it's poof. that guy. Like, like, come on, man. Like, <laughs> the one on the road. I'm not even racist, I'm but the, by, hey, you're, you're pushing it. Back. You're pushing it, bro. <laughs> so I left uni. I was like, ban that, ban that. And then that, and then I ended up doing performance art from yeah. stage and TV. But that was. And you're here now. And I'm here now. Give me a juxtaposition of 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 that moment where you're telling your mom, Kuti, ah, uh, this is what like what is the complete opposite of like the moment of realization, like, hey, we took the long way road, but we're here. Like the moment where she looked at you like you you're that guy. I mean, like do you do you have that memory where it's, it's a performance, it's an event, it's something that you set up or you're giving a news or um or maybe it's not triggered by anything, but she just yeah, no, gives I, you an opposite of of that way. She's just like, hey, I get it. I mean, to be fair, she's been supportive every step of the way. That like, I know. So ever, ever since the morning, she's like, yeah. I get what you're saying. So, But I think... Um, Where she felt like her faith was repaid. Okay. That because part of part of her supporting, that's just yeah, filial love. That's just yeah, her being yeah, a mom. Yeah, 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 incredible yeah, yeah. mom. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right? But I'm saying where she's now... It's not her being a mom where she's supporting like, by default, but like, like hey, hey. hey, that nigga kind of sick. I think it might have been at one of the um, showcases at university. Right. Um, one of those assessments where you have to perform. Right, right. You know, a little play type of thing. And uh, I did... I did... I did a play... I, th- I did a scratch... Uh, scratch performance of all of us. The, mm. the play that I did and what no, I did yeah. a, a scratch that that was in its early early form, like very raw. Yeah, I did a scratch for that for my dissertation, and she she came out. She was like, "Rude boy, yo, I'm seeing BAFTA. I'm seeing nah, Emmy, even even my I'm ste- even my stepdad was like, yo, yeah, yo, yeah, rude boy, go on." Like, hey, go on, yeah, man. Yeah. Wait, wait. Yeah. <laughs> my stepdad says, yeah. hey, go on. Yeah. Go on. <laughs> yeah, it touched. Yeah. yeah, even I was, even even myself in that moment, I was like, <laughs> nah. If you didn't feel that, you just nah. a hater. Nah, you're. I was like, yeah, 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 nah. yeah. I'm on the right path with this one. Nah, those those moments are needed, man. Yeah, yeah. Those yeah. those. So so so. This is this is this is. Uh, what, what was uh, it? Not yeah. no no. We are not even because we would ruin the flow, right? Uh, I feel like if we did that, we would ruin the flow because I like I like uh, I know we're going to do that originally, uh-huh. right? But with the turn that this is, I'm I've place myself in the shoes of the audience. Okay. Where I feel like of all our nonsense that we speak about, uh-huh. people are actually getting an insight of who you are. Yeah. An appreciation. So if I was to now but they would also, my, but, but they no, would but also I get think, an insight of I think who let's you get, are. I think let's get a full app- today, let's get a full appreciation of you. Oh, okay. But so, so this is let me who who's who who am I? Where am I today? <laughs> Where am I channeling? Where am I? I'm I'm Girl King. Oh right. I thought you were gonna I'm say Trevor to... Nubi. No, I don't. I don't like. To... <laughs> hey, the amount of people that I I don't. It's all. It's all. Who who's who's renowned? Ah 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 ah. Where am I going, Girl King? Mm. I'm Ola. Oh Ola. So 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 I'm not just... So tell me something. So tell me something. Yeah, tell me something. So you're, you 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 were the one. You were you were there. In Nottingham, you yes, were, yes, you were an ancient zoo. So Nottingham, yes, no, so so so. W- w- which year is this? 
This is two thousand. The dissertation. Oh, the dissertation is yeah. now two thousand and sixteen. Two thousand and sixteen. It's now two thousand sixteen. Is the year I graduated. You are trained. I'm now a trained actor in three years. Four years. Three. Three years. Now trained acting. Paid your dues. I've, I've, I haven't even paid my dues. Yet. No, I mean, uh, I mean contracts. Yeah, my trainer. Oh, in yeah, well, Namums. Yeah, I'm yeah, like, yeah. She said, if you're I'm like, hey, go there's that your route, degree. Yeah. Uh, hey, you've got your photo. Exactly. You've got your the gown and the. Yeah. You let's got do that. Okay, now. let's get to Guavonomics. So, so, so I, 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 I want now the, the, the initial post. Oh, the early days of the, the early Wav. days. What, what were yeah. your expectations versus the reality of? Whew. So, I think I had the benefit of being slightly more mature compared to my castmates. So, right. as I was in Nottingham, when yeah. I was thinking, I'm gonna jump, I'm gonna jump. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I uh, I don't know if you'd remember this, but I messaged uh, Tongai. Right. Um and I was like, yo, you know, this I'm kinda thinking of doing mm. this, right? Ta, ta, ta. And he was very blunt and mm. like straight honest with me. And I think I needed to hear that. Yeah. He was like, Bro, if you if you wanna be an actor because you wanna be famous and rich, mm. just don't. Just don't don't do it. Just yeah. leave it. But stop right now. There. Stop right now. Don't. There's that Tsumuga, you could see Tagabana, Goku, Munga, Akuma, Nai, Akuna, you put it. Not even if Goku, Munga, I know that is, bro. There ain't nothing over there for you. Baga Zongwa, you just went there. Akuna, you put it. It really was Kumunga. Akuna was the original contingent that was sent to Kunotraga. They came and they're like, hey! There's nothing, bro. They ain't got nothing there. It bro. was just niggas. Just, <laughs> ah, the amount of great tangle that we had to do. Great, great seven, bro. Oh my God. So Tong, <laughs> Tonga is telling you like Wang. He's like, no, nah, don't do it for any of that because honestly, you're going to be disappointed real fast. Yeah. And then I introspected and then I started looking back on my entire I interrogated my yeah. entire history, like yeah. my life, and it was all there. Yeah, like remember, I was telling you one time when we were, we were doing the Christmas episode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. my first ever role You're that I remember, that like the, when I was five, whatnot, like, yeah. like like thinking back at every kind of like drama, You're little always minor, been a performer. I was dance the, the oh, nigga that. who's I would get the leading parts even if yeah. it's a small little classroom yeah. but I would I would remember how seriously funny enough I never got any leading parts on the green but really? I attribute that to oh like me and the lady that was responsible we were beefy <laughs> you know you know those teachers that beef with kids yeah, yeah. oh she was oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But because I was <laughs> I was on some performance noise maker what, what, what. Yeah, yeah. so she was just like you're unruly Mugu's unruly like, you're, 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 she never gave you a chance oh because she, she she didn't want to reward you with, no yeah she, she didn't want so to she reward you so she would always place me on some you are the guys that take out my chair but you are the <laughs> scene you are changes my kitten basically we would we would basically oh, you go to scene you're to, a tree you are basically <laughs> doing the de- like do you know those switch scene changes. <laughs> She would make us dance as the scene changed behind us. That's the hairy shit that she was on. We would go and break dance and what? What are we changing? What are we turning it into a bedroom? That's insane. That's insane. There was an interhouse drama competition that yeah. was similar to that, and I remember they didn't give me a part in that. This yeah. was in high school now. Yeah, they didn't give me a part in that, but me and my homies yeah. said, "No, no, no, that's fine." We'll do the scene change skits. Yeah. Brother. That's the highlight. It got to a point where people were waiting for like, when is this scene <laughs> going to change? change? Because we were going in. That's sabotage, man. Bro, I got runner up best male performer for that. God, that. It was crud. I, I vividly remember that. But yeah. anyway, yeah. 
So I, I, I so I interrogate myself. I I do like a comb through audit of my post. Like you know, sometimes you have to G check yourself. Like, yeah. am I guessing it? Yeah. Like really big man thing. Am I yeah. guessing it? And then after looking at all of that objectively, like, no. I was like, <laughs> I got this, bro. I'm 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 that guy. I'm good at this. Yeah. I'm good at this. And it- now in the early days when I leave, um, so even then. I remember one of the first lessons that we had, but because my attendance was bad, um, the first the first time we we started the course, there was one of these like senior senior kind of donies in the school, yeah, head of department or some shit like that. I don't know. I don't know. He came and he told us he was like, "Hey, this is very it's a very competitive industry." Yeah, reality is a lot of you might not ever work. And yo, God, you could hear a pin drop. And God. then people were like, oh, some people were vexed. Ah, they came out, because bear in mind, this is people who've come from like performance art colleges. Youth Why would you college. tell me Why this? Why would you yeah, say but that? That's I mean, that's, that's, you know, that's, they're not supposed to do that. It's, I just think it's very unfair. And that's that's what the yeah I bet that speech has changed in this in in my in head sensitivity yeah time. in my head I'm thinking mm, okay you know what nothing really new mm. I kind of heard this mm. all right so but anyway I'm I'm persistent mm. and then when we get to I think it was second year now yeah. second year second year now you had to choose what you want to specialize in you had three options specialize in directing performance skills yeah. or arts marketing. Mm. No one wants to do arts no. marketing. Everyone wants to do either directing, but mostly performance, performance. skills because that's yeah. where you learn voice I mean, if work. it's hectic, acting, directing, it's hella. Hella, right? Hella hectic. So now, because everyone wants to go to one of these two, no one is voluntarily saying, I want to do performance. You're still going to be doing acting work and acting yeah. exercises but it's just the focus yeah and they said that you can so because because they wanted to make it fair they said priority was going to be given to people with the best attendance <laughs> me the when they said that i was like right okay. show, show me show me the performance art uh, arts marketing cue then let me just what what I didn't what even, was happening with your attendance ah uh, my attendance was just terrible because i'm commuting i hate commuting uh-huh. i'm commuting to highway i'm catching a bus my lectures are some stupid o'clock and more often than not yeah like performance art people and actors more times they love just chit chat. Even mm. sometimes when you start a new job, when you're yeah. in the rehearsal room, everyone's just like, I think the character, right? I think he's the way he is because his mom never loved him. And everyone's just like over intellectualizing things. And I'm like, the, the curtains were blue because he was feeling sad. No, nigga, the curtains were blue because they just fucking blue. Let's get on with the scene. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? So that I couldn't stand. That used to piss me off. Because I'm like, why why am I sat here learning theory? Right. I want to act. Let me know when we've got acting. So you... When we're actually acting, acting. You were taking liberties with... I was taking liberties. Like my grades would be like, half of your grade is based on the performance. The other grade is based on your how you've conducted. How have you been showing up to meetings, rehearsals, mm. your contribution, whatnot. Most mm. of them is just goof, goof, de goof, goof. And sometimes I'll show up on like the last two days of it and the performance is over there and none of them niggas have done anything. And then now I'm actively at the helm of devising and whatnot. But when it comes to the to the grade, I, the grade would be so lopsided because they'll be like, Manasha was barely here. But no one is mm. going to be honest enough to say, but actually 70% of the stuff that we ended up doing in the thing mm. was... Okay. But anyway, that was another beef I had with them niggas anyway. And then I had one lecturer that hated my guts. That was, if I ever have a moment where I was how like... Big were the, how big were these classes? 
Um, it was about so there was about sixty of us on the course. Right. So it would be in three groups. So there'd be like twenty twenty in a group, and then right. So enough it. for the lecturer to actually know you, you guys know, like, personally. Mm, yeah, yeah. In this yeah, court, yeah, 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 they, they, they. Yeah. Also, you're black. Yeah, and also there was a hand like few of us. I think there was three black guys. So it was like. <laughs> Shadek, Misha, and, and, a bed, bed, and a Billy Goat. <laughs> <laughs> ah, brother. I was a standout as well. Yeah, but that was like the same time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And so now we start arts marketing and I'll never forget this nigga, he says. And he wasn't trying to put people off, the mm-hmm. lecturer. He was just trying to, again, show people that it, whether you act or not, there are means to be within the industry and make a living. You don't got to be an actor, actor in front of the camera. That's yeah. what he was trying to say. But yeah. he said one bar, you were, again, he came back with a nine out of 10 of you. I never going to work and he says and when i say nine out of ten of you i don't mean working in hollywood no 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 i mean i never going to ever see a paycheck on a consistent tip for just any acting work carried out to say i live on this god damn i looked around i was like I don't know about y'all niggas. <laughs> but it sounds like that spot is gone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the one. I am that... I'm, you know when Django said I'm that one in 10,000 nigga? Yeah. yeah. I had that speech running in the back of my head. I was like, nah. Nah, I'll be damned. <laughs> if you any one of y'all niggas. But also at the same time... Mm. I'm also actively doing stand-up comedy. I'm on meeting the comedy circuits in London, yeah. right? And I remember one one rehearsal that I missed because I had a, I had a gig in London, and the lecturer laid into me. He was like a like a like an associate kind of lecturer who just we had just come in to do the ensemble kind of project because you have to. As part of the course, you have to learn to work as an ensemble, big ensemble production, what not, what not. And that's the guy who was doing it. He hated my guts because I'd be late. Hey, G, 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 ah, ah, you know, you'd be like, you're not serious. He just looked at me and he just counted me off from the jump, 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 cut my lines, bare lines, bro. I ended up just being a nigga who just walks across stage on some <laughs> treatings. Yeah, I'm not right with you. <laughs> Sir, so so so. Uh, what what? Uh, I guess what 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 I wanted to get to mm. is this is. Uh, I mean, w- this could easily be a three-hour podcast because there's just so much to get into. But I want to, I want to speak things into existence. Oh yeah, bo. Right. What's your ideal scenario? What What is the thing, 10 years from now, what is the thing that you want to excel at? 10 years from now, that what? You, you, you know you want to dedicate yourself to, mm-hmm. but you want to excel, like, like, outstanding in that particular field. Um, because you've been trained... She's gone through the paces, 2016 the paces. up until now. It's a that's a healthy that's, amount bro, of time. That's almost a decade. You know, been... uh, uh, one would argue that you know you've gone through your ups and your downs. You've gone, you've been the top dog. Ukraine mm-hmm. didn't work out. Ah. You know things, things like that. You know, there's other projects that you've told me that you were in the running for. Ah, oh, scary uh, the, things that you've done that just didn't work out. Mm. But we've we have we've created all that context, right? I think it's unanimous amongst the people that you are very talented. People see wonderful things. I see wonderful things in your mm. future. But what do Prophesy. you see for yourself? Prophesy. Because it's one thing for people to see those things. But for right? you, for yourself, you'd be like, like to yeah. me. It's similar to 
I love moms. Mm. So you scientist in English, but you didn't see that for yourself. I was like, I ain't seen science. So that we can help you, you know, the audience, lovely people, black and forth. Can you help you in manifesting The BFF gang. Manifest BFF, with me. You know. Uh, okay, so <clears throat> I think... I wish again. I've, I've, I, I actually meant to 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 post this at some point this week mm. on um, on Instagram, but I think I just ended up holding off because Damson Idris ended up posting his <laughs> his audition tape. I was like, ah, oh, that 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 now that just looks now like you I'm, now that now now just looks like I'm gonna be biggish, but I think <laughs> I, I I don't think I don't think. Niggas, particularly even in the Zimbabwean, but in the Zimbabwean sphere of things, mm. realize just how it's one decision away. Mm. Like, mm. and that's the allure of it. Mm. It's dangerous. It's gambling. It's it's just one. One day, like mm. the difference between things working out and but the, the, literally the difference between like a Damson Idris and myself mm. is one meeting, mm. like one one decision that just in mm. my favor, and the amount of ones that I've gotten to where I've really thought. Oh my God, this this yeah. might be it. Yeah. And the pain of seeing these big projects come out mm. and they're massive and and people gawking over it. Yeah. And I'm thinking, do you know? Do you know that how close I the was. producers and the people behind this thing sat and looked at my headshot and my tape and whatnot? And at some point they were like, "But this guy, though, like that, yeah, like that, yeah." It's 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 equally encouraging as it is disheartening. Yeah. Because then you think, oh, is another project that suits me like that ever going to come? But then after a while of doing this, mm. I, I think I'm well over a thousand auditions in now. Teflon. In my career. Yeah. Like, I don't, I don't like... Does it get better? Like the rejection or the things not working out? The Does rejection... Get better yeah, the rejection gets better. Mm. Hun- oh, you, you just end up getting a thick skin. But then it's human nature because there's certain jobs that you the really feel ones. like... I would, it's meant for me. That this is me. like you, 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 you look at the script, the character breakdown, and you're like, <clears throat> "This is me. This, um, I got this." But it just goes. And what are you going to do? Just was size a more decent room. I'm not going to do it. And then we're going to wrap up billboard. Man, fuck, God. So what is Damn. it that you wish for yourself? What I really wish for myself, I think I've now realized my strengths. As much as I'm I'm a terrific writer mm. when I actually sit down to write. Mm. Right. I, I don't know. Sometimes I just don't have the follow through and the bandwidth for it. Right. But where I thrive is where you just tell me X marks the spot. Here's the script. Run with it. Where I don't want to have to be like, oh, I need to write first draft, second draft, third draft. Mm-hmm. Uh, this, speak to the producers. Uh, casting, who's the uh, costume? Uh, I hate that. But once I immerse myself in it, I'm pretty good at that. Right. So certainly at some point, I want to produce my own things. Uh, I'm working on a pilot. Um, mm. You know, touch wood. Pass it through. What no more. Manifest with me, guys. Come on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, Where but, do you want that pilot to go? <coughs> so that they know what to manifest. Yeah, no. That anyway. I bro. mean, you don't have to say specifics, but I'm guessing... You wrote a pilot mm-hmm. for something that you want produced. Mm-hmm. 
and you are manifesting that some serious people with serious pockets get a look and into it and they decide green light this is something worth it to produce this is what we want to produce are you are you are you are you do you write it for somebody else or do you write it for yourself are you I'm selfish right wrote it for myself but I, I don't, I don't think then, that's selfish but then I, I, but, but I wrote it for myself but then it also has room for to... I, I don't think that's selfish because even even if you even if you look back I mean, the different context. The they write stuff not for even, and the chewing Not even, not even that. Not even, not even. The, I mean, that's more recent. Mm. Matt Damon, Ben, uh, ben, ben Affleck. Affleck same you know the the, the, yeah, the yeah, movie yeah, that yeah. really yeah, brought yeah, yeah. them to. Yeah. They wrote that, they wrote that at school. That was the Stallone. Yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah. 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 So so we we we've, we've these are people that felt like, I mean, especially in the case of Sylvester Stallone. Mm. He wasn't going to get somebody to give him a second look. Mm. So he writes this brilliant story. His one condition for it I to gotta be... I got to star in it. I got to star. And that becomes the movie where his entire... Gets so I, I don't think that's obvious. Yeah, so no, yeah. suppose, so that's, that's, that's what we are... That's what yeah, you're but, manifesting. But I think ultimately, I want to... I just want to... I, I want to act, man. Yeah. I just... I just... I just want to just... I just want to... I just want to do... Good, and I've, you know what I've always said. Yeah. I don't even think I want to. I, I, in fact, it's not even. I don't think I know. I don't want to be that household actor name. But you know, there's actors that you don't know their name. Mm. Most, more often, you don't even know their names. Mm. But when you're walking past the TV and you see the nigga in a scene, you think, ah, oh, oh, I know, oh, that guy. Why? Why is that? Why this is must that? be a walk good, me through that. And then you think this must be a good movie, and then yeah. you sit down to watch it. But there is often a, there is often a correlation between household name and no because simply I don't I don't you don't want the pressure that comes with it's not so much the pressure that comes with what no it I wouldn't call it pressure but mm. I I just don't want to be very conscious and mindful of everything that I'm doing well, the, in the, the public the responsibility eye. yeah that comes with being a brand name I've got reckless but, tendencies. Mm. <laughs> you don't want to be out here. <laughs> no, man. But I mean, with 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 your level of talent, I want to be a Mark Strong kind of actor. You know, right? Ah, like Guy Ritchie. Y- usually, you know, they, them them Donnies that bills are paid. You'd have to just when he shows up, he kills it. You'd have to see him to be like, oh, that's Mark Strong, and all of a sudden you think of fifty movies he's been in and he's been solid in it, but you. Don't know his Mark name. Strong right? is in the Kingsman, right? Yeah, that's the he plays the Scottish guy. No, the, I, I, the, the I, guy. I know him yeah. mainly from Guy Ritchie movies, but yeah, I was yeah, yeah. exactly I haven't watched Kingsman because at some point it just became very ridiculous. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I I had to to tell myself like, oh, they're doing this intentionally, right? Mm. Because sometimes yeah, 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 yeah. Because it's like no, no, <laughs> like, no come on, they, they were just taking the piss. But I, 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 I feel you. I feel you. Yeah, man. I feel you. I just want to BAFTA in the God. making. Do you do you see that? For, you, is there something that you wish for? Is there something Emmy? Ah, oh, in my future. Yeah. I can see. I can ask her to you. Right. No, I don't really feel that in my bones. Right. Because I'm delusional enough to. No, think no, no. That. I'm uh, but uh, delusion aside. I'm. I, mm. I wanted to ask more specifically, like, if you when you see that Emmy or Oscar, is it for writing? Is it for acting? What is it for? The only thing that I'm, when I say writing mm. or directing, the one thing that would get me out of my seat to really say, yeah, this, we got to go hard. Yeah. Is a very, it's a story that has a Zimbabwean essence right. to it, to yeah. its core. Right. Either something that's set in Zimbabwe or something that, the narrative is driven by like it's related to Zimbabwe yeah I, I want to zim on the map like that like represent represent some proper one wave type shit Neria type yeah yeah like ooh like ooh yo yo that's that guy did you see did you see that movie from Zimbabwe and and, and to be honest I think I yeah. think zim even in terms of for a country that starts with the letter Z, <laughs> Zimbabwe is very easily marketable. 
Because for some reason, I don't know how this happened. Mm. We have this weird talkability about us. Like so many things that are like for for of all the countries that were linked with the British mm. colony and 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 they had a back and forth with uh the royal family. Zimbabwe ranks very highly up in terms of the tiff between Britain, even this whole yeah. local com- commonwealth, right? I mean, so much so, one might even say it's because Zimbabwe was the, one of their most beloved colonies. So it was it was painful to let it, was, it go. And then you throw in the whole Mugabe factor, mm-hmm. right? And then you throw in the whole, you know, we're pretty distant to cricket and, and all that. I think we're doing. Uh, I'm saying that to say I think we're doing that. We're doing ourselves a disservice in terms of not picking up some of this low hanging fruit. Oh, yeah, that's true. Because genuinely, I think there will become a point where the world will lose interest. Right. The, like, no, no, it's just them inflation niggas. Yeah. Like, come on. <laughs> yeah. It's some at some point, but we have so many good stories. Even turning the 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 whole the whole Hondo mm. Eminda. Mm. Into a into a feature film, mm. you know. Mm. Even even the whole, I don't think very very few countries have a dramatic lib, like dramatic liberation war stories as us. Yeah. First Chimurenga, Chinoy Seven, Buyane Handa, the whole Mapfubangwa Chamuka, you know, the whole second Chimurenga, Lancashire House Conference, Bro, Tongo Garas, Kawa. No, not bro. even to mention the, 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 that, that war when the, the Portuguese invaded yeah. back in the day, the Russian people, even, back in the, from, like, you can stretch it. Or even even if from, you, even 2017, Kuh, cool, not a cool. Kuh, all, all of that. All of that. This, but, this, it's so the tapestry. It's, is yeah. So I, I feel you when you say when you tales. say you want to. Would you play a, 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 a Robert Mugabe? Because I think we could, with makeup we could. Yeah, I think we could. We could with, with makeup yeah, we yeah, could yeah, 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 make yeah. you look I like a, somebody said you look like Kieran Coughlin. Yeah, I saw someone say that, and I saw someone say I look like Tinashe Mugabe. Nah, I don't see Tinashe Mugabe. I kind of see it. When I, I did the parody of... Uh, is that why? And then someone was like, yo, the nigga kind of looks like... I don't get the Kieran Coughlin part. But Kieran Coughlin, Cal- yeah, I don't get that. I want to know why they say that. I like, I'm know. curious as to how they made that connection. And that guy was very serious. I could I could hear him. He, he must have really watched No, 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 no. Oh, wait, wait. The guy who commented that, I looked oh, yeah, like yeah, he, he was, was like, nah, but hear me out. Hear me out. But also, it's not bad people to be lookalikes. Yeah, Resemblance or not, I think because Kieran just swept up the whole Emmy Yard yeah, leading yeah, yeah. actor. Yeah, that's cool. You know? That's cool. So I'm like... I like that. If they're seeing you in that realm that of Emmy nominated... I I I I I I like it. I like it. So give me that energy, man. Guys, you 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 know what to do when you pray. When you sit down, these are things that we're praying for. Just just say, hey, just you know, I mean, please pray for all the important things that you're praying for. Don't move things. What's what's okay, up? Sorry, sorry. My eyesight is. Because I, oh. I was looking for the dot, but all right. So. It, by the way, hey, pardon first song about black and four thousand Munashi. Hey, Mari, hey, I'm a mona, Muma audition room from by now. Varungu Rabba Bakashandra Kau, Rama Baba Baka Conchi, Zika Rabba Bakashandra Rada Baka Tanga Kuona Kalama in Lotion. Hallelujah. <laughs> I got to go color my lotion. Hey, man. Oh, oh, yeah. I hope we look back on these and yeah. be like, hey, man, do you remember the time Taka got No, up? but you know what? The, st- it's the stand-up has been creeping back up on me of late. Yeah. Uh, but you see, unlike, unlike acting, yeah. where stand-up goes askew for me again, yeah. I, it, this, and I've only started to come to terms with how I work and my yeah. strengths and yeah. where I like. And, you know, sometimes you might try so hard to be like, no, let me let me try. And then eventually you just realize, man, let me just do yeah. work to my strengths. But 
I love stand up, but stand up is dangerous because everything is down to yeah. you as an individual. Yeah. No one's going to say, oh, yo, it's, it's it's time to write your jokes. Can't no, name anyone. No, no one's going to say, you've got rehearsals at 9 a.m. Or even say, here's the words. Oh, right? There's no, here's no, the words. Like, writing my own words, I'm fine with that. Yeah. But it's the sitting down to write. Yeah. That, no. It's, there's a lot of sitting down with your own thoughts. There's a lot of sitting down with your own thoughts. There's a, there's a lot of... Uh, I hate the mundane. Yeah. And there's a lot of boring stuff yeah. behind it. Like it's very tedious. It's very te- I admi- which which is something that I think I've I've said a million times and mm. I'll never stop saying it. I really really admire your your discipline cuz that's what it is. I think it you get to a point where it's not about motivation now. Because you can't wait for motivation. It's discipline over motivation. Like, am I motivated to do this? No, I'm not. But I'm disciplined enough to know that, no, fuck Bora Ruitwa Ababa TV. I just have to... I have to call the booking agent. I have yeah. to call the venue. Yeah. I have to call the marketing guy. Yeah. I have to book the tickets. I have to make sure that the posters are done by certain, certain much of time. I, yeah. you know what I mean? I need to speak to the sponsors. I yeah. need to schedule this and that. Like there's so many things where the onus is on, on you. you. Yeah. Before we even get to the jokes it's a it's a very it's a very lonely pursuit it's in terms so of, lonely yeah it's it's a very lonely it's so lonely you have to inc- love it incredibly you oh yeah, yeah. The, oh, the, you yeah. have to love it in, oh yeah i was having a conversation oh, yeah. with uh, uh nigel i think mm. i probably have had this conversation with you do you know like i i have these moments where i'm like if i wasn't so good at this stand up thing or just i i think i would be a behind the scenes guy Really, I enjoy putting things together, man. You do so well at that. I you I would, enjoy you would excel. I enjoy putting. At that. I enjoy putting like I I you would excel making at sure that. things making sure things happen. Mm. Like okay, we don't. And I think maybe the thing that helps me a lot with the stand up is what I think my biggest talent is knowing what's funny and what's not. Which is hard because uh, everybody like it's one thing to be funny, mm-hmm. right? But it's another thing to be able to measure the degree of funny. Yes. So there's levels to the funny. There's levels to the funny. So in 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 the ability to know, like you you get an idea and to be able to tell yourself, like this is not worth developing that and taking it. beyond. Leave it. This is only. I see that because you can lose time. Like I see that every time I sit down to, like most times, more more recently when mm. we're editing the podcast. Yeah, yeah. Most people don't know. Like sometimes this podcast is hella long. Oh God! Right? Oh God! And you're sitting yourself and you're like, no, no, that ain't it. That's not it. The, yeah, yeah. That, like this this part, somebody would be gone. I think that's an instinct thing, yeah. and I think yeah. that. You're either born with it or you're not. Or you or you're not. So now when it comes to stand up, now it's the ability to know, like, okay, we are starting here, mm-hmm. we are ending here. Mm-hmm. We are going this. I think that's even if even if I was uh, somebody said to me, like, hey man, we're having a back and forth, and they were asking for advice and what, what, what. And afterwards, they really appreciated the advice. They were like, hey man, if you want, I really think you would really excel. And I was like, hey, huh. I didn't say it, but I was like, hey, I think that too. Man, but, I'm a, but I'm yeah, the, the, I, 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 I find also, this might be just be a, because I'm an egomaniac, <laughs> right? But I love giving advice. The only problem is not many people love like, accept. Like so I'm favorite. only restricted to giving advice to my friends. To people like, who really want to take my, it. Like my sisters, my family. Bruh, I'll, I'll, I'll sit you down. I'm like, sit, come here. Sit right. Down. This is what we're going to do with your life. 
I've been blessed enough to 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 have people who to listen. Have people that are, 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 value are, are, your yeah, not even value, but I think they have enough humility mm. to be like, it's a tongue, <laughs> <laughs> but it's coming from a place of love. But I think I yeah. think that 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 that's what that's what transcends. Kuti, it's it's uh, it's coming from a place of love, and we're trying to get to this. So. They'll more often listen. I have these conversations with, you know, be it my dad or be it my... But sometimes I also have to check myself like, hey, Wang, again, coming from a place of privilege, you know, some some of the things. It's one thing to suggest. Do, you, um, is it so I think... Okay, no, 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 These are hypothetical things. No, my hypothetical things. But yeah. no, I, I totally hear that. Yeah. And, oh, man, that on its own, yeah. because... In the grand scheme of things, funny and that's very subjective. Very subjective. That's very subjective and whatnot. There's a lady if, who if, mm. there's a lady who was tagged on a recent video that everybody was going crazy about. Mm. Like tagged by a family member who was like, "Hey, what's this?" And this lady came and said, "Ah, that's." Uh, there's know. something about I'm not getting they, it. I'm, uh, no, there's uh, I they they said ah, there's something about that just put me off, right? And I was like, uh, uh, I I like hearing people. I was like, mm-hmm. hey, is there something that I can improve on working? Mm-hmm. I'm just like ah, no, 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 it's okay. It's just not my preference. It's not you. It's just not me. Fair. Yeah. That valid. that is very valid. Valid. You, uh, and even the way that she said it, it wasn't coming from a mm. position of hate or what what she was tagged she responded like maybe your spirit made the demon uncomfortable and said <laughs> <laughs> but but okay. that is the thing that i've come I, to that is the thing that i appreciate that bro i la- never expect to tell a joke to 100 people and get 100 people to 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 find it funny it's just impossible yeah. it's just impo- impossible bro there's people in this world who believe beyonce is not older there you go why stress yourself? With- Why would I? S- there are people that walk this earth that believe that Lionel Messi is not the best football player. Why are you to ever st- grace exactly. the football? Why are you pitch? stressing yourself? Allow it. You're, that's that's you're how I think about it. Like I'm, I'm okay. That's it. There you go. I am okay. But you see, where no one can beef mm. and say what not, yeah, is work. Right, right. Yeah, okay, well, no could be far. Like we can we can, we can just... never we can never like right now we can lay lay we can line up ten comedians yeah. from Zimbabwe and you say who's the funniest? Yeah. And you different get answers. different orders and different answers. I mean not but really, but it... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Comic no, relief. Comic but relief. it's relief, it's relief. But if you say, yeah. given the preview, like having like an insight into people's yeah. work processes, yeah, yeah, if it was to be exposed to yeah. this one, okay, this is work process, yeah, who you yeah. work, nigga, 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 nigga. Yeah. The things that people don't really see at the back, but I think some people who really pay attention to things see yeah. it. Bro, I, I don't think anyone outworks you, bro. Like, like and I, 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 this turns where I, I said this all the time. I was like, how many, how many niggas this nigga got in his fucking garage working away? <laughs> <laughs> and I, but, but, who said who found out my door and sat down, but pinned that way, I was starting to feel like it's a sweatshop. Who, who's and, there? And you just got a bag of slaves. There's just, just no way. Just no way. This one guy has got this out. I, I I I really think it comes from a place of from from a place of toxicity. No way. It really does because for me, it really is from a place of toxicity where I'm like, I remember the nights where I wasn't in this position. Fair. I'm never going back there. And I'm not. If I'm going back there, it's not going to be off my hand. Okay. Right. Let, let it there be is, some circumstances it, beyond your control. Uh, the thing that I always try to think about is, in as much as we we are fortunate, me and you, fortunate enough to have a lot of people rooting for us. Mm-mm. These niggas 
not rooting for. Like, I'm not yeah. even talking about passively. Yeah. I'm talking about people that wake up. I don't know who they are, but I know there's people that are. I I know that my was, enemies. I've come across. I've come across. You know, you sometimes you come across whispers of of things of people who who would say things to discount. Really? Yeah. Like there was a, when I was back in Zim, people would attribute. You know, people would attribute my success to to Magamba. Like oh, I I'm like, do you know? I'm the first person there. I'm the last person there. Out. I'm not being handed this. Mm, uh, that like, is my salary. I'm, I'm earning this. I, it's a salary. Like there will be people that will be. There, there will be people that will look at that celebration center thing and be like, ah, oh, it's, 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 it's just a diaspora thing. So do it then. Do it if it's that just. A... You know. So so I, I I'm saying that to say we we've, we've been fortunate enough to have a lot of people rooting for us, but part of me working so hard is really that I don't ever want to give anyone a foot in. Like, like right? That prayer is going be- because I feel like some of those prayers start working hard when that complacency starts working. When you, when you, yeah, you know? when you take your foot off the pedal. Yeah, but 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 now, but but that that minimal minimal in terms of motivation it's minimal compared to lost my mom i would have loved for her to have lived long enough to see us win an emmy yeah do you yeah, know what i mean yeah, yeah so i'm like now wherever but she, she saw some wins she 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 she, 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 she saw, she saw she, bro i'm every time yeah, I'll enough, come enough, across, enough to be supremely she, proud she, of she, you. she 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 was extremely proud mm. but now it's kind of like we can't get this far to only get this far. That's true. Because there's, there's, there's. I remember somebody telling me that, Oh, hold my camp. What was we sell out Leicester Square Theatre in London's West so, End? Hold that. Yay! What are you talking about? Man, shut yeah. up. So, so, so part of my motivation is I, I, you know, wanting to get to a place where I can buy my wife a house with an island kitchen. Mm. You know, oh, yeah, sent yeah, yeah, yeah. Maita and his siblings like to 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 the best no, 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 none of that, none no, no, of that, no, no, no. none of that. So, so, so it's it's really, <clears throat> I, I I think most of, most of it, like I said, working from a place of toxicity. Like I I can't imagine this getting, but also it's a motivation. Every day. hey, I don't want to ever prove some of these doubters right. Mm. You know, mm, because yeah, I that. I. My story, I mean, I don't like how you turn this around. This was meant to be your episode. <laughs> Tempted no, to edit no, no, all of no, this no, out, no, but no, this no. was it's, meant it's, to be no, your story. No, 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 it was, so, it, it was an insight on both of yeah. our journeys. That's Because uh, I was um, going to ask you, your your dropping out of uni yeah. and what was your no, journey? Nah, well, I it's wanted to, but, but to, to that, yes, anyway. I really, want to, really wanted to, to for it to be... Don't want to give anyone who just the naysayer. I I've been fortunate enough to get so many second chances, third okay. chances. Mm. Dropped out of uni, I ran away from home to enroll myself in an A level. Passed, went to Rhodes. Wow! Well, for wait, all wait, wait, first you know wait, that's uh, a, they will do that another yeah, uh, bro. No, I've lived a crazy life. I wanted to hear that. I've lived. I will, will do that. Uh-huh. I, I, I we we I, I I I want I want I want I everyone. I want no no. I want <laughs> I don't want I want I don't want to distract people right uh-huh. because I know some people will only have the bandwidth for one comment on YouTube, and I want that comment to be specific to the things that you said. So that we don't have, we have people zeroed in to your story and learning more about the things that make you tick. And we haven't even scratched the surface. Yeah, no, of, I mean, in terms, uh, of, gosh. in terms of, in terms of, we got sidetracked. You're telling us mm. uh, about, I uh, put a pin in that. But yeah, my thing to conclude what I'm saying, my thing is I've gotten so many second chances. Mm-hmm. I've told myself, 
this is the chance. This is the chance. Gonna, you're not going to ask for a fourth one. I'm going to make it work. <laughs> mm. So that's when you see like the, the whole let's build a studio and let's what, what, let's find this, let's make it work, let's what, what. It's coming from a place of this is my chance. Make sure. It's it's one shot. But you were yeah. speaking, the thing that distracted us was mm. you've been falling back in love with stand-up comedy. Yeah, man. I, be, I, I, I really I really have been falling back in love with stand-up. Um, where, do you, where do you stand on it now? Where do I stand on it now? Uh, I think the thing with stand-up is the more you do it, yeah. the more certainly for me yeah i'm not i'm not a stand up that has that whether i have a show next week in a month or what yeah. not regardless of when of what my show schedule looks like uh i have to do x amount of writing or what yeah. or just to just sit down and write jokes like i mean you see me <laughs> i mean i'll be writing my set as people are filing into the venue type shit. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck <laughs> Azar. Time for stuff. Uh, so, certainly, I think with time, uh, as as it is right now, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm starting to be more, because I don't know how you write, mm. But how I write, whether it's stand up, whether it's the, the a play, or whether it's a, a short or whatever, mm. I don't actually sit down mm. to write until I have a pretty strong idea of right. what it is. So I just kind of index things in my head. Right, right, right. So by the time I sit down, I'm sitting down to structure. And right. to make things not so yeah. click click. So certainly of late, I've definitely been more open to oh, that's a joke. Yeah, yeah. Catching those thoughts and right. letting them brew. Right. Whereas normally I'll just be like, ha ha, that's funny, and the thought just goes. Right. And then I think, yeah, I'm going to revisit that, but you never do. No. They, they just go. But now I'm certainly making a strong effort to be like, ooh, 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 Bella. Go in the rumination pot. Yeah. So, yeah. But, um, and given our, 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 our love that we're getting and yeah. what we've got planned for the year and whatnot, hey, your boy gonna have to be writing. I'm excited. Yeah. I'm excited. I'm, I'm, I'm really, I'm really excited for for more stand up comedy. But performance, well, both of them are performances. Uh, like both of them are performance arts. <clears throat> what comes, what uh, acting. Uh, uh, I don't even want to say it comes naturally. What's because both of them come out pretty naturally, from what I've seen, from what the audience has seen. What's your first love? My first That's, love. Yeah. <clears throat> Again, I think looking back, <sighs> it's. Ooh, that's tricky now. Yeah. Because what I think I love was or is the reaction right from people jay z bonnie and clyde wakati what are it's baba blue attention um what i love is the reaction mm. uh the the gratification comes from an outward reaction from people evoking an emotion now, that's again that hardly answers your question. No, but it kind of does a little bit. I, I think what's There's more technicalities. What's, what's definitely more immediate is comedy. Yeah, stand up. It's hundred yeah. percent. Yeah, but even if it's acting, yeah, if it's comedic, yeah, it elicits more of an instant reaction yeah. than yeah. But I also really love you know nailing a performance where. Yeah. Everyone just goes quiet. I think for me, when 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 I saw when I saw all of us, 
right? I was like, yeah. That 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 didn't even feel like a perform. I don't think that was a performance. Mm, mm, mm. It just looked like an extension. Like we are, we are voyeurs. <laughs> You're just peeping in into into somebody going through about their regular. So I get what you mean about. I guess for you, you're just a junkie. Yeah, you're yeah. a performance yeah, junkie. Yeah, I'm, I'm just a performance it, it's junkie. It's not stand up. Yeah, it's, it's not acting. Mm, you want to perform. I just want to. But I guess when you now put the, the whole thing together, ideally you would pick the one that gives you the less grief. Right. Exactly. You would pick the one like okay, S- straightforward path. If if I have to live with one, mm-hmm. if I'm being handed a script with a guaranteed role, I'm doing that. I'm doing that. Oh, oh, I'm, you're gonna find me in my trailer, right. and you know, saying, "Okay, I see this. I get this character. Okay, what if I played him like that? Right, right, oh, right. right. Yeah. And then, ooh, yeah. ah, that's because I think with 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 stand up, the thing that I can helps. do twenty hours on yeah. set. I like. Yeah. I I don't. That's, I'm, I'm, I've seen you're people get tired. About, you're like, not worried oh about God. who's welcoming the no, guest, no, who's no, what, no, what. No, I don't care about that. No. I'm just on set. I'm standing. I'm watching the crew yeah. do their thing. I'm watching the grips move the lights. You're not Even, giving the you know, tech guy playlist. No, 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 no. Right, with Johnny guys. And, and then when I come in, I want you to play. No, you're no, not no. calling anyone who wears the microphone. No, no, no. Hey, stand up. Hey, you see? I mean, of course inevitably yeah it goes without saying yeah. that um we are going to get to that level where we don't we worry don't, about we, those we don't things about those we things, don't yeah. worry about those things but my point is to get to that yeah you have to worry about those one things. simply has to go through that baptism of fire and that's why like i was saying like mm. man i, I re- like i watched you do that prodigal no not even conspiracy theories mm. that was the first one isn't it yeah 2019 yeah and i remember you posting videos and you going around with the physical tickets like yeah yo my one one like i was like yo that nigga is Grinding. That was crazy. I was like, that but boy. Stop trying to make this about. Let me, I'm Ola. I'm Ola. Right. To 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 conclude this uh, okay, episode, Mr. Chirisa. Let's wrap it. Uh, to to wrap, wrap it, up. it up. What uh what advice do you have to upcoming actors, what people advice? that might be dabbling in this a uh, uh, profession? Profession. What, what what would you tell them? Again. I will just pass on what I got told. Mm. Uh, some of some of the most memorable bits of advice that have stuck with me, mm. and it's not a lot. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Because you have to chart your own advice. way. You, you, you know, you have to. Yeah. You, and basically, you man is giving no, terrible advice out here. No, you know. I'm going sifa. Okay. Sifa smashagat. But. The first one being from, again, from Tungai, if you're going to do it because you want to be famous and you want to yeah. have money, don't do it. Don't. Don't. Big banda. Don't, bro. I've been, I've been, the la- in the last two weeks alone, I think I've done 10 auditions. Yeah. In the end, and chances are I'm going to get zip mm. from that. It, it, it's just, and yeah. it's no discredit on your part or whatnot. Sometimes you walk in, the director and the writer, as they were reading the script, they had a certain image in their head of the person playing mm. it. Or, you know, and then you just walk in and maybe the way you dragged your chair and sat down just, eh, I don't know. Yet. 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 I know like to like to go to make to act. <laughs> And then what was uh, scratch? But you've acted your ass off, and yeah. you really can act. So it's re- and again, it's no you know yeah. stiffy on your part. But if you're going to do it, do it because you genuinely want to, mm. and not to be bleak and demoralizing. But you also just have to be fully prepared. If yeah. if the idea of it not working out ever. Or it not working out to the degree that 
you'd want to see it work out as is too much for you, mm. stop. Though you need to be able to just be like, hey, man, I just do... Charge you to the game. Charge you to the game. Mm. Ah, Because there are people who... I see people who are like 60, 70 years old uh, on set as extras. They're just happy to be extras. They've lived their entire life. They're just happy to be the nigga having a cup of tea in the background of a scene. And mm. to them, that is gratifying. Yeah. That's fine. So if you're not in one of them ones, allow it. Second piece of advice, um, this stretches across all kind of forms of creativity as well. Mm. And I think this came from Kyle Joshua, mm. actually. Uh, get good before you try to get seen. Mm. A lot of times people are trying to get seen before they get good. Yep. Like, I've had people come into my DMs. They're like, ah, hey, man, uh, can I? Can we do a collaboration? Uh, here's, here's my work. And then they send me the the, the stuff. And I'm like, yet. Yet, bro. You're no, I don't like to make the... <laughs> I don't like, bro. You trying to make me a villain. Like, bro. now you're trying to make me the... But now you want to make me the you villain in your origin story. Like, you want to make me the guy... Like you want to be motivated by Kandoro Sage. No, you see. But I'm always kind enough. And it's those people in particular, I actually respond to. And I'm like, yeah, mm. yeah, you know, what, no, what, no. And I've had a couple of young niggas who have seen, and they, they, they're killing. They're not like killing, killing, but yeah. the improvement is, look at that. Look at that. Yeah. Now, if you then approached me at that later stage and whatnot, how nice would that have been? Now I don't have to look at you sideways and have to f shuffle for nice things to say. Yeah. Right? Uh, so yeah, get good before you die to get seen because we will see you in your infancy, in your poor fate, in your whatnot, and then we're going to end, you know, <laughs> some celebs and them comments and whatnot. They will kill you mm. and then now you're demotivated, lack oh, of self-esteem yeah. for no reason. And make stuff for you and your friends until was it that one thing that someone says, Yo, I gotta show somebody yeah. this. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's, and I think those are the, the, the two bits of advice I can. Mr. Shiris, uh, this is the Kandoro shit. 7 podcast show. Kandoro uh, 8. <laughs> Kandoro 8. Kandoro 8. <laughs> uh, we thank you for, 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 for availing yourself. No. Uh, it's it's been wonderful to be on your podcast. Yeah, uh, we... And it on next time. Let's see what you put in my notes. I don't know. I'm going to go Marvin. The streets are saying it's an anzi. Dimi Magavaro 500. Because that is why, because theory, your recollection is, is so on point. It's so good. People are starting to think that you were actually the person uh, well. who was the victim. Uh, but hey man, uh, another episode, another one. We tried to bamboozle it, but this is really a uh, Monashia story. Uh, uh, I was saying he tried to bamboozle. He tried to bamboozle. No, you tried, tried to, to bamboozle tried because because uh, I I was I was very keen on hearing that your was the original plan, but then we got things. we got into into a deep and you laid us nicely, and I was like, man, we let's not make it a chaotic like. Juxtapose Ningrini. Let's hear the story Nyatso Nyatso. Oh. That, uh, let's hear this story Nyatso Nyatso. How it happened. Pace. Because I know for a fact there's somebody who's in that position right now. Mm -hmm. Be it Zim, be it mm -hmm. here, be it. They look up to you. Uh, they want to hear how you did it. They want Fair. to. You, you, you remember we have guys that we were looking up to. You know, mm. if it's college dropout, Kanye, mm. uh -huh. if it's 10 Diamond. Bro, 10, hey, People ten, that ten, you were ten leaning diamond. to, like, he did it. 10 Diamond um, wrapped me into... That's one exactly. part that I, I, you know, I now actually feel bad because I completely... Because that was a very... Yeah. No, very th that's what I was saying. Like, this component. This story of... And we'll, of keep, we'll keep coming back I to it. I listened to Student of the Game. Exactly. So... I was like, yo, this man is speaking to me. Yeah. Man, I was like, fuck I this shit. Sin. 
Hey. Hey. But hey, man. Uh, what goes go, Baba Ushe? Oh yeah, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love how he's so Father low key now. Father. He's so low key. Well, like just what, 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 what would you get el- 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 elsewhere? Yeah, that's true. I like it. I you like know, it. so it's so family man. Yeah. Shout out, shout out, shout out to you guys. Uh, if you've got into the end, if you if you if you had the bandwidth to sit know, through the dredge that was Nash's, you know, that was not dredge. I I know somebody was a hell inspired. And, I, and hope, I hope I inspired someone. You know, so shout out. This has been another episode of. But I don't know. So do some guy was here. Now you know. sounding like those people. Like <laughs> one in ten. One in ten. I gotta be real with you. One. Man said nine out of ten of y'all niggas are never. But hey, this is another pod. This has been another episode of the podcast. You didn't know you needed another one. The yeah. tenth one. Yeah. Damn. Probably not going to be the 10th because we don't know when they come up. But... Okay. Fair. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be one what's, of them ones. What's the problem? I might die next week. <laughs> oh, that is true. This has been another. Uh, these are the cliff notes that we edit out. <laughs> <laughs> these are the bits that. If they make it to the port, because somebody's getting arrested. These are the ones that don't yeah. e- make it out of the cutting room. Yeah, but. Hey, this has been another episode of the podcast you didn't know you needed. But now you know I've you been do. King Kandoro. And it's your boy Munashi. Black and forth. We are. We'll be black next week. Peace.